it's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, everyone. Hope you're doing well. I'm tired. <laughs> it's been a long day. Let me get lit up real quick. I am smoking number four. Number four on our countdown. Uh, this is a great Virginia. Um, it has changed hands as far as ownership two or three times. Um, how many times am I gonna say um tonight? But let's get down to it. This flake is a pure Virginia flake. Um, as far as any kind of topping or anything like that, I can't I can't detect anything. Um, this is these flakes have been in here a while. There's just some broken flakes, but it does not come as broken flakes. It comes as really nice square flakes. And you guys have probably had this blend before, but I just think it's a really good sweet Virginia. It's uh, there's really no frills to it. It is what it is, um, but uh, it's. I'm smoking the Dunhill version of it, but it's also available as, well, now it's available as Peterson Flake, and as far as my understanding, it's still the same exact recipe and blender and everything, just just a name difference, but I bought a bunch of these, uh, the Dunhills, right before they, I knew they were going away, so I, uh, I bought a bunch of them, just because they're easier to date, uh, as far as you so, show somebody a tin, and they'll say, yeah, that's, that's, an, that's an older tin, it's Dunhill, it's kind of like, when when Murray's was the blender of Dunhills, if you got something with Murray's on it, you know the date is is old. So I decided to go ahead and buy some, and I have not had the Peterson version. And but again, it's there's really no uh, no difference. It's the exact same thing, um, except you know the name change, uh, the blending, and and everything's the same. But it's very good, um, so smooth. Very sweet, as I said. I like to smoke it in uh, this pipe here. This is a Costello uh, shape 16, I believe. And uh, it just smokes flakes very well. A lot of people say that smaller pipes smoke flakes. I actually like bigger pipes for flakes. I'm just, I guess I'm just weird or different. Smaller uh, pipes, I like to do ribbon or, or ready rub stuff on that. But number four on our countdown, most like McClellan that you can get today is I got to definitely say it's Dunhill. Now I had to redo my top five. If I haven't already told you, um, within the past week or so, I had recorded a bunch of these videos doing my top five. And then I had to go redo them because I was introduced to a tobacco that I had, I've had it for a while and it's been aging. Um, but a friend of mine popped it in and said, Hey man, you got to try some of this. I'm like, well, I got some. He's like, you got to try it. I was like, oh, okay, okay. And so, yeah, I tried it, and then it kind of got into my top five because I've been smoking it for the past week. Um, and so that'll be coming up. Uh, I'll tell you the one that dropped out. Um, it was, it would have been uh, Best Brown Flake. Uh, number five would have would have dropped out, but oh well, something else had to drop out. And I will let you know which one it is because I already did the video on <coughs> Best Brown, so I'll put a little asterisk on that when we get to it <coughs> but anyway getting over a little bit of a cold as you can see um nothing bad just just a little bit of chest con congestion that's all uh, i don't maybe the pollen but it seems we haven't had rain in a while so it could be the pollen anyway um been doing a lot of filming on on my next music video I have some uh some people reach out to me to help with the uh, lead singing duties. So as soon as I get this next song wrapped up, we're gonna see what they got. I think I'm gonna actually redo a couple of the songs that I've already put out in the playlist and and uh, get their take and version on it and uh, republish those. Um, since I've got a lot of new subscribers and a lot of people probably hadn't seen them, um, and, unless they've been back to the uh, playlist anyway it's been a long day i'm just talking nonsense right now so i'm gonna get back to smoking number four dunhill lake
Peterson Flake now. So go get you the Peterson Flake. If you're a Virginia lover, you never had it. I can't imagine you haven't. But if you haven't, definitely worth a try. Um, again, it's just a Virginia. See if it does. Let me, let me see if it has any kind of uh, description on it. Uh, nope, just warnings and and that's about it. It's also got 1978, but I can guarantee you that this is not 1978 uh, right here. Yeah, it says 1978, but made in Denmark. I don't know. No description. I don't guess it needs one. It just says Virginia pipe tobacco. Anyway, Peterson, Dunhill Flake, whatever you can find, get you some. Peterson ready, readily available. I've never seen it out of stock, um, but... You know, that's just, they just make a lot of it. People buy it. People buy a lot of it. It's a good tobacco. Go out and try it. All right, I'm going to quit rambling. I'm going to get back to my pipe and relaxing and looking at stars and thinking about my next song. What could it be? Oh, I think I'm going to release a little teaser coming up. Maybe this week. I may give you a little taste of what's coming up. I'm super excited about it. God bless everybody. <laughs>